Hey guys, welcome back. It's my papaya, you already know. You know I said that I post two times, at least two times a month. But this time I actually have a reason why I didn't post because your girl went to Jamaica, period. And that's why I got that little tan. But I'm so sorry I wasn't able to record. I was not trying to raise that bill. Today is going to be a school video. Guys, so we are just about to go to Bath and Body Works, right? Yes. And yeah, so I'll see you guys when we get there. shopping and um as you can see i got some stuff right here and some stuff here but this is like stuff from like a couple days ago so i went to bath and body works i went to marshall's we just put it in a tj max bag i went to famous footwear let's get started so first what i got from bath and body works they have a sale going on that each hand like the pocket hand sanitizers are one dollar so I got 10 and my mom got 10. And then I got um, like two little travel size things for school. So I got a lotion and I got a body spray. I got pumpkin pecan waffle. It smells really good. I advise you guys to go run. Don't walk, but run. Run to your local back and body works. And yeah, it just smells so good. Like, hold on. smells really good and then they didn't have the lotion which i was really mad about because i wasn't about to get a big lotion like who's doing all that so i just got cinnamon apple honey that's what it looks like and yeah and then um i got 10 hand sanitizers so that's all the stuff that i got from bath and body work so now I'm gonna just go over like the three shirts. This is one of the shirts that I purchased for back to school, but I just wore it today because why not? I don't know, I thought it was really cute. So um, I got a MTV shirt. This is what it looks like. And then I got one of the, uh, one shirt that says cowgirl. I really like this cause it's like really thick material. It's ribbed. So like, yeah, it's really thick. And it has like little like rhinestones and I really like this top. Now TJ Maxx, because I'm saving the best for last. A Patrick Star hoodie. It's purple and it's really big and I love that. And on the sleeve it just has Patrick like with different emotions. I think this is like a really cute sweater. I love it a lot. And yeah. So that all the stuff I got is from Marshalls. The shirts that I just showed you guys was from TJ Maxx. And this shirt is from TJ Maxx too. I got a pack of socks because you always need socks no matter what. Some shirt. It's a sunflower one. So yeah, that's this shirt. These are this is all from the men's section. So if you guys want to know where I got this, where I got these good tees from is the men's section. So go to the men's section and find you some great shirts. This is one of my favorite ones. It says avocado and then it gives like the description. And this is the front. So yeah, got some Sour Patch Kids socks. I'm gonna share this with my brother. These are so cool, actually. Like these are really cool. I think that they're long socks. So shoot, if you see me the second week of school with some shoes, some shorts, a uh, graphic tee, and this, don't say nothing to me. I'm gonna be a Sour Patch Kid. Sour. And the last thing that I got from Marshalls which i know is not really like such a big deal but i love my phone cases now is my favorite part famous footwear so i just got a nike lunch bag so i just got one of these it's just pink it says just do it and then there was one but this is what they look like i love these so much i love them a lot just that This is 
Amazon. Oh, I'm out of breath. Let me do that again. Ash, get out the kitchen. Anything else? I mean, not. <sighs> hey guys, so I literally just, you know, I. Hey guys, I totally almost forgot which I didn't. I was tracking this package and I literally thought that they were going to like ship it to me tomorrow because Amazon is always late some for some reason for me. But let me cut to the chase. I purchased a tote bag. I'm going to put like the photo of what I purchased and then I'm going to like put it in the description if I can. And it's a pretty good size, but we're going to really test it out. It has two small pockets. Ooh. If I can open it, dang. Hold on. So it has like two small little pockets in there. And I'm just gonna see how much it can hold. And usually when I order like stuff like this or like, you know, like little clothing items, sometimes they, you know what I'm talking about when like they smell. It, this doesn't smell. I'm just gonna test out how much it can hold. And I might as well just do like a mini what's in my book bag haul. So this is my book bag for this year. It's a very badly book bag. So we're gonna do how much, like see how much um, stuff this can carry. Four, five star um, folders. Wait a second. Oh no, I actually have five. I literally thought I had four, but I have five. And I'm just gonna see if that can fit. And then I have a grid notebook. And then I have a one, one, um, Second, I have two notebooks. So I have a grid notebook for math and I have a one subject. Next up, what I have in my book bag is a three subject, five star notebook. It's just in the color white. And there's still a good amount of space still. I Next up, I have a five star planner to match the folder. Then I have my pencil case. I'm wondering where I got all this stuff from. I got it from my local Target. And also this pencil case, it's really cute. It's by, it's by um, the line called Noted but the brand posted yeah they made um a line called noted and it's just really cute and like really much just like aesthetic um school supplies so definitely go get it so as you guys know we still have the three notebooks five and the five folders so i'm going to put the planner and the pencil case so there's still a lot of space and the last thing that I have other than index cards but I would just keep that like in my locker but um the last thing I have that would be in my book bag is a binder this is what it looks like with everything in there it is a little bit heavy just because it is three notebooks and all that stuff but this is what it looks like on me it's pretty big but it still has a little bit of space. If you are a person that doesn't mind a couple pounds on that shoulder, I would say you could put everything in here. But honestly, I would say like don't don't put too much stress on yourself though. Yeah. So that is the last thing for today. And yeah. Hey guys. So it is uh September. Wait, what's today? The eighth? Oh, hey guys, so it is September 7th, the day before the first day of high school, and I just got some stuff, like, to close up my haul. I'll be getting, like, shoes later, but this is basically, like, the whole haul, like, the rest of it. So, yeah, so today I went to Target, and I went to Hollister. So, I'm going to start off with Target. So, first I got a gray cami. This one is, like, kind of cropped to my nails. Hollister. So yeah, uh, these are $25, and this is like an emerald green color, and I just really like it. I love this detail, and I got it in a size large, so it could be like fitted, but like kind of baggy too. So yeah, I got this, and then they had a matching hoodie but or a sweatshirt, but I was like, mm, I don't want the sweatshirt, so I got the baby tee. And this is how that looks. I got it in a size medium, so it could be like close, but not too close, and yeah. That's how it looks like. These jeans, which I am so surprised that they had in the store because I was gonna order them, but I kind of messed up the address. So actually, no, my phone, Hollister did that and I had to cancel it, but I didn't even know that they had it in the store. So I was like, oh shoot, okay. This is regular length and they have just two big rips on the knees. 
and i just really like it it's really cute and yeah they're like baggy two more items i have this nice crop top it's like a cropped cami actually but it's knitted and it's like nude colors i really like it because of the pink and the white and like all the colors basically and it's really nice the last item that i got were these jean like they're basically like jean cargos and they're brown and then it has white stitching carp okay so then set over so my last item are these brown jean carpenter pants and they have take three my last and favorite item i got are these brown jean cargos and it has white stitching i love that detail it makes them look like very retro vintage like basically how the black baggy jeans that they used to have with like the white stitching I'm, i'll put a picture like right here and they would wear like the little cami with the stripes on it with the yellow and the red that is so cute to me mm -hmm.